Uh, so inclusion criteria are the way we determine who should be in the trial and exclusion uh, is more based on who shouldn't be in the trial. So, um, and that's based in generally, but generally both on what might be effective and on uh, what, what might be safe. So one example would be sometimes the inclusion criteria might only be for one particular type of mutation in a gene. Uh, because perhaps that's the way the, the drug is designed to work. It works only on one mutation. And so while you may hear, oh, there's a trial for muscular dystrophy, when you go and look at it, it's only for a certain subtype that has a particular gene mutation. That's disappointing, but if the, if the, if the drug is designed in such a way that only works on that, then, then you're not appropriate for inclusion. Uh, exclusion criteria it can be harder because if it is a, it is a therapy designed you know, for you to be included, exclusion is often when there's some other complicating factor that either uh, worsens your risk or decreases the likelihood it's going to be effective. So for instance, if you're some trials, quite a few trials actually will exclude patients who are also receiving another experimental therapy. And so the reason for that often is because it'll either confound the results or because the, uh, th there might be some ad additional toxicity. Uh, and that's hard. Anytime, anytime you hear about a, a trial that you're interested in for your child and then it turns out uh, those rules are keeping you from participating, um, you sort of feel like that's, uh, uh, you know, you, you sort of feel left out in, in, a, in, a, in a way that can, can not feel good. Who makes the rules? So it's, it's interesting, the inclusion and exclusion criteria are uh, contributed to both by the investigator at the site and by the sponsor of the trial. Uh, and those, um, those inputs are all subject to approval at the institution by the uh, Institution Review Board, the IRB, uh, which oversees the ethics of, of, of human research, and by the FDA uh, that that regulates the, the use of investigational therapies.